All right, guys, welcome back to a video. Hopefully, you guys are all having a great day. So, this is my final game on Modern Warfare 2. Uh, I know the game has been out for a year, coming this actually this year, um, next couple days or whatever. But um, my final review for the game has been up and down. I've had mixed Switch feelings with this game this past year to the point where I didn't even want to play the game to be in the area. And some other times I just got really bored of playing the game. So, you know, go you know, play other games. Um, I'm I just felt like the game had a lot of potential, but when they took away that game, that made the game more fluent and everything else, but and then taking the red dots off the minimap, that's kind of something that kind of screwed the game up you completely. Oh, I feel like the game had a little bit more potential than what it should have, especially with all the movement changes. Uh, bunny hopping was something that people used a lot. Um, I felt like snipers were kind of like up and down, like there were some hit detection issues when it came to sniping. Um, I know there's a lot of, like, scoping problems where, like, uh, I'm scoped in, I'm area. pressing the button, but there's such a delay in between on trying to, you know, scope in fully, and then, when you do scope in, it's like, you're, you're in the you can't get the gun up, but, hopefully with MW3, hopefully sniping comes out a lot better. I know I've probably made this commentary twice about how I think better when it came to the beta, when it came to sniping, but there was, you know, it's a beta, that's what it's for. Um, I know there's a lot of things where video uh, based matchmaking was a big problem. I'm not really a big fan of talking about it because there's much to talk about. So, I mean, I know there's a lot of hit reg issues. Um, but I still died in the first kind of thing. And I felt like it was just kind of, it was horrible. Um, I know some people just get the, get the shot on or whatever, but I've seen people get clips off the ass with, the with some of the snipers. Um, I know SPR was pretty brutal when, first, when the game first released, but uh, no sight. You were just picking people off. You were just getting kills no matter what. Attack uh, 6 was a good, a good gun at one point, and then they kind of knocked to the ground this past couple seasons. But I'm not much of a red gunner, guys. So that's kind of why I was kind of really kind of weird about how sniping was. Um, I did get Orion camo this year. I got the camo. Kind of, kind of happy about that. It was a grind though. Uh, it felt like some of the grind was a little bit tedious, especially when it came to like long shots. I know there's a lot of people have talked about all this all day. Um, like if you watch some of the gameplays that I've uploaded, the sniping time in between tick for the time it takes to bring the scope up is sometimes ridiculous. You know, the sprint fire speed, just give us a perk that can you know, help us, you know, at least give us a chance to snipe pretty well. That would probably Hostile be a better, better thing for everybody. Um, I know that I've had some pretty decent gameplays with sniping. Um, I just feel like some of my shots are uh, Warzone was a, kind of a bad one for me. The dolphin diving and then the sliding, and you can play it while you were running. You had to like stop and play, and lay down to play. That was kind of ridiculous. So I feel like this game has had its ups and downs. Past couple seasons, I haven't played a, a lot. I've played more. Like, I played a lot more like older school cods. MW2 but pop back on to Black Ops 2. And those games were great. Like I felt great. Except for the new pips from you know Modern Warfare 2. The original Modern Warfare 2. Um but 
I'm excited for MW3, guys. I'm hoping that the uh, game is phenomenal. Um, I hope Warzone, the new iteration of it, is good. I'm excited to find it. The one shot snipers. I'm ready to test my sniping in the new game. Um, I know the aim assist was pretty bad in this game when it came to Warzone. I know that there was a lot of things that were broken in the game when the first game was the game first released. Like I'm learning. Just no pets guys, raw raw commentary. Um, so as I was saying, the game was pretty broken when the game first released, so we were Take, take some of that to our advantage. So there's two gameplays, this gameplay guys, there's this commentary and stuff, and I'm hoping that I can actually do the full commentary. So, you guys, you know, stick around and enjoy. Um, I've had a lot of problems with packet burst and stuff like that, and what I don't understand between the cross-gen bundle and everything else with the games. Once you buy it on one on one console, I'm with you. you should be able to just you know download the game and play it cross gen, whatever gen or whatever console you have. I, it kind of confused me. On this gameplay, I'm playing on PS4, which is the shitty fucking quality of the game. Which I mean, it's it's better than nothing. But uh, I w had to pre-order my game on Xbox Series S. And that's gonna be it's gonna be interesting because I've been playing on PS4 for the last few years. And before I was playing on Xbox, it's been years since I played on Xbox, guys. So that's besides the point. Um, I know there's gonna be issues with certain games. I know they're gonna be. I know they have to you know fix some stuff or whatever. But Infinity Ward didn't really. Take a lot of what of feedback and what, what, what they decided, and then people want to go fuck themselves, pretty much. And that's that's my opinion. Um, that's kind of the way I've seen it over the year. Um, I know with Warzone new iteration coming out, I don't know how the camera is gonna handle all this because, like, I'm ready for. New, 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 new. You know, even though they're recycling the fucking game, basically, just and just throwing back the changes that we had from Modern Warfare 2019. But that's, that's kind of my, my thing. I'm kind of nervous to even play the I know that the game's gonna be, you know, faster. And I, when I play Combat Master. That game was hella fast, guys, compared to what we're playing, what I was playing on the beta for Modern Warfare 3. Combat Master was a whole lot faster, and that was kind of kind of fun. It was really fun when I played it. Um, but ever since the PC went down, I know within this year I'm hoping to have it. Like I said, I'm really trying to get that going. Um, because I want to get back to, into keyboard and mouse and stuff like that, but Switching the whole point of my conversation, guys, is that I don't want to see the game fail. With how this game here played out and how they just kept, they didn't change any, change really a lot of nothing, pretty much. Just basically, uh, told hit. us all to go fuck themselves. That's the kind of what the frustrating part. But I'm with you. Sniping was one of the just I fucking done for for a long time. Um, red gunning. Some of the guns felt really good. Then the other guns just felt like. Um, being played across the street, and then, of course, bundles is another thing that broke the game, too. So it's like, I, I shoot you first, but since you got this bundle here, you, 
just gonna blow up my whole entire Loading. body before you I even get like four shots into you. That's kind of what what sucks about transactions and shit like that. So it is what it is, guys. Like I'm 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 confused on you know they keep doing it. Uh, I get it. But it's like got we need to make it pretty well equal to compete if that's how you're gonna run the game. That's just my opinion. Um, Covering your six. I don't like the double zoom scopes. That was one th another thing that I disliked about this game. I'm used to one scope and one scope only. Like that's not something that I enjoyed. Um, kind of like what you see with the SPX here. You got the double zoom. I just don't like that. More of a bolt action. One's one scope, zoom, that's it. But it seems like the more we play these, it's like it's it, they make it work. It's you gotta have the double zoom. And I can I can understand that for like Warzone and Ground War and shit like that, but it, for multiplayer, not really. Uh, I'm just not a big fan of the whole double zoom scopes. I'm more of like a, like I said, just a one zo one zoom scope player. Um, attachments, attachments were horrible. They basically all said the same thing, but then they would they would perform differently. I'm with what you. They, what they were going, going by. So that was another thing. I just don't agree with a lot of the attachments. Make them stronger, make them do whatever, but like, I'm don't make them say the same shit to where you're basically screwing up the attachment in general. Um, I, I mean, it is what it is though. Um, I'm just making, you know, points across. Explosions uh, when you shoot down kill streaks. That was another. Th that was a. That was a weird one. When I first started playing this game, um, whenever you t shoot down a kill streak, and all of a sudden it would land behind you, well, you can't get away from it because by the time you even move, well, it's pretty bad. so that's that was another thing that kind of was like, oh my god, what are they doing? But. At the end of the day, it was kind of a cool concept because you, you get respected at the end of the uh, at the end. So it was a really cool concept, but it just happens to you. And it happens. It happened to me a lot. Um, the packet burst thing. Uh, that's been an off and on thing for the past couple of years now, where you be in the middle of a game and all of a sudden you're packet bursting. Everyone else's game is completely normal. Uh, I mean, it could be an internet service provider, it could be anything. But, uh, one more. We're gonna get into DMZ for a minute. I didn't really get into DMZ all that much. I, like, I, I, I was gonna find out and try and do, and try and do you know, try and unlock, unlock a lot of the stuff. Just didn't work go the way I planned. Then I got bored and didn't want to play it. And then I started, started just, you know, getting guns from the friends who had the gun, the mask or whatever, and that was it. So, but I do like the fact that now you can unlock the gun. You know, like when you do it, uh, fuck, I can't even think of the word right now. Not the battle pass, but, you know, ah, oh, whatever. Um, you can just earn the gun by doing certain things to unlock the gun, like, uh, hit fire kills for pistols or hit fire kills for SMGs. That, that was a cool concept. I like, I actually like that. Hopefully we can do that with some of the operators instead of... Having us here and constantly deal, deal with bundles and stuff. So, um, I like 
the camo that they did for the ghoulie camo. That one was sick. It just the whole grind was tedious. So I'm I'm trying to come up with better ways to make this better, and not make you guys you know see it from my perspective as a player. Um, I'm a sniper. I, what I do in every COD, I enjoy sniping. Um, I enjoy making people frustrated with sniping. Oh, you heard still. Even on, on, on my TikToks. Oh, you heard scooping. It doesn't matter. It's sniping, guys. You guys get this idea. Gotta be. Um, I'm reloading. Guys, I'm, I'm trying to stay focused with, with this whole thing, and it's hard to play this game for long periods of time, especially after the Orion grind. That one, after the Orion grind, I just, I got lazy. I didn't want to play. So, I think that's kind of why I didn't do a lot of ranked gameplays. One I didn't do a lot of um, Warzone gameplays. I didn't do a lot of DMZ gameplays. I was just just bored with the game, to be 100% honest with you. Um, I feel as if this game had better potential than what the devs even gave credit for. Uh, they had a, a really good opportunity to make this game a, a really good one. But the fact that they did was kind of that's frustrating. Um, Red dots on the minimap could have been, should have been a thing the entire time. They should have never even picked it up because, well, that's how we find players. That's how people play the game. That's how we've always played the game. So, anyways, guys, I hope you guys do enjoy this video. I'm, this ramble is all over the place. I'm not very good at making this kind of commentaries. Okay? So. Guys, if you guys did enjoy the video, you guys can drop a like. If you guys are new to the channel, please hit the subscribe button. Um, we'll be back with another video with the uh, campaign. I will talk to you guys soon. Hey, everybody. I'm out, guys. Peace.